<laughs> that's better. Oh, that's a better one, yeah. <laughs> the boys. G'day, happy Friday. It's uh, Friday afternoon. Myself and Lee have just burned out. The conditions are actually pretty slick. The sunset's going to look really nice tonight, I think. Uh, light southwesters, a really strong southerly current, which works well with the southwester, luckily. Um, yeah, hopefully we can get something on because I haven't had any fish in the freezer for a couple of weeks due to this storm. And I went out this morning and had a bit of a crack. Um, I caught one little fish. I'll roll the footage for that. But in the meantime, we're just going to kick back, get some baits going, and hopefully we can get something on that we can eat for dinner. Got my anchor smack on top of the lump. I'm just waiting for the wind to blow me off the back. And then I'll slowly feed it line. So I'm in six, seven meters now. And then I'll just slowly feed it anchor rope until I'm right on the edge where that seven drops down to 10, 11, and that's where I'm gonna stop. Anyway, good morning and happy Friday. It's just me by myself this morning. Sun's just coming up. It's my day off. Conditions are not too bad. The forecast is not ideal today. For this morning, it's meant to be quite strong from the northeast. Northeast, never my favorite wind. It's kind of stiff, it's bloody freezing. But I'm out here, this is not really about fishing for me, this is just about, this is my day off, this is a bit of a chance to chill, come out, kick back, drink my coffee, I'll throw a few baits out, if I catch a fish, I'll catch a fish, if I don't, you'll probably never see this video anyway, but yeah, just a chance for me to chill out, meditate and breathe, so I'll get set up and then I'll talk to you if anything happens. Oh, here we go, that didn't take long. It's not huge, but I'm sure it's not a skippy. Well, uh, 11 minutes I've been here, so I was only just getting the burly going. Just about, to put, just about to put another bait on that rod there, and I've hooked up here. Hopefully, this could be the fish I'll come after. The weather's just been so bad lately, I just haven't been able to get out regularly and get fish, so I'll be happy if this is a good dinner-sized fish anyway. As much as I like to catch big ones. That 65 centimetre sort of size, 60, 65 centimetres, is just perfect eating size for my family. It's one nice meal. And now I haven't even got my net ready or anything. And he's probably going to be just a little bit under that. Nice little pinky. He's probably going to go just under. He's got that hook right in the corner of his jaw. That HP, HP tackle, lazy yockey there as a spicer. Um, he's under anyway. I'm pretty sure I'll, I'm not even going to bother measuring him. I'm just going to put him back, see if I can't get the next size up, the one I'm after. Plus, he can go back. Hopefully there's a bigger one out there. So I'm on 13, oh, right there. And there's my drop off. Should I go over it again? No, no that's fine. It's gonna go forward a little bit and then drop the pick. And by the time the rope takes up, it should be sitting back in the 17s, 16, with the barely heading towards that bummy, hopefully. And today for Burley, we got some crumbs I scored from the fish and chip shop last time I was in there. I asked him for some crumbs out of the deep fryer. He said, no worries. So I've got to put that in the Burley pot. Another handful of muleys, nice and oily, get it happening. That's my first bait, half a muley, single 7-0, HP tackle, lazy yockey. I've actually got some striker scent. It's glow in the dark scent from striker. Ah, uh, Psycho Chicken, I think the song was called. It, I think it glows in the dark pink. Anyway, I smeared that all over the um, Lazy Yockey. 
get this out first bait. Hopefully this one will be the one that gets the job done. Small one, I think. No, I had a bit of size, had a good go. That's all right, it's a start. That was something at least. He got I was getting a touch though for sure. Something hanging around. So, my bait was getting pretty close to the bottom there, so I thought I'd just wind it up and cast it back out because I always like my baits floating down through the trail mid water. I did a couple of small winds and then bang, this it hit. Um, this is actually quite a big bait I got on here too. It was like half a scaly I had on. It was like a decent fish and might be the one we came for actually. It looks pretty good. It's not huge, huge, but. Same. Seems alright from here. Oh, there's the skippy. Following it up. Oh, he might just go size. Oh, no, he's going to be just under. Big fight for a little fish. <laughs> yeah, he put it. Yeah, I thought he was a lot bigger. There we go. Look at that scaly bait right there. Little lazy yockey from HP. He's actually smaller than one I caught this morning. But he had a good Aussie go. Credit to him for that, I suppose. Oh, he's a nice little fish. We can go back. See you, mate. Touch, touch, touch. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Skippy. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm on. Well, that other one just got a bump in as well. Yep. It's another. Skippy, I think. Yeah, I think it might be a Skippy with those boom, 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 boom. Head shakes. That was a big bait for a Skippy. <laughs> That's a snapper. Is it? A little pinky, yeah. Oh, it's a sign then, at least. Hopefully it might. Hopefully it might turn on. Yeah, I've got a couple of tags left and I've fixed up my little tag pole thing, so I'm going to stick a tag in this guy. Just in his shoulder here. Click. In it goes. Um, quick measurement, so we know what we're dealing with. Watch out. So he's 35. 35 centimetres and 32 to the fork and he can go back in and now I send that I send the data of that tag back to um, oh, what are they called again West now? Tag. West Tag, that's it send it back to West Tag they compile all the data, put it all in a big spreadsheet which um, fisheries have got access to and if anyone catches him again they email me out the recapture details how much he's grown, how much he's travelled um, how long it's been before since he was tagged so pretty cool um, I think I've only got about two tags left I haven't been using them heaps but I think I might have a couple more left so if we get a few more I'll tag them as well while I'm at it Lee just got a savage hit yeah that looks like a better one a savage hit and then it all went slack so he left it because he felt like he still had some bait on he got a pretty decent sized bait go the other side yeah Big bait. That reckon? sounds like a better sort of fish. I'm just going to put this here. You can film yourself for a second while I get the net ready. <laughs> I feel like that's a net fish. Yeah. I don't think it's. I don't think he's too big. Oh, I hope, as long as he's eating size, I'm happy. He drags pretty loose. Nah, no, it's actually. Oh, you could probably go another half a turn, I suppose. I don't know. I think you got his number. He's eating size, but I don't think he's huge. <laughs> making calls the first one was pretty making bad. calls before we even see it how's the sunset yeah, get me the sunset as far as the other side It hasn't really done much, has it? It's just lugging it out down deep. Oh, it's got a big head chase. I really like this river. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What an afternoon. It's actually beautiful. I came out this morning and it was actually pretty ordinary. The north easterly was really strong and it was white capping and not pretty. It's actually really turned it on this afternoon. Fighting like a squid. <laughs> It's probably another giant snook. <laughs> nah. Dino snook. 
Um, I'm going out in the morning with Jack, so hopefully the weather's like this. Well, what was that? It was on the surface. Yeah. Now, should I make Lee net his own fish? I reckon I should. No. You always, yeah, you always make me net my no, fish. This one needs to be you netted. <laughs> Get his head up. That'll do. Yeah. <laughs> cool. That's a good one. Well, that's a nice fish. That is dinner, unfortunately for him. He's got that hook right in the corner of his jaw. That HP Lazy Oki. Dinner fish. A quick measure, see what we got. 65, 70. He's perfect eating size. 70. Though. My favorite eating size. 70, I, don't know, I think you're talking it up by a few centimeters. Yeah. <laughs> perfect eating size. Now, let's get a few little nips. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Something on that. Strike. <laughs> nah, it's not on there properly. Something's definitely have a look though. Now, let's get a few little nips. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Something on that. Strike. <laughs> nah, it's not on there properly. Something's definitely have a look though. Big spell, just one there. The bail arm open. Oh, the bail arm came open. Here oh, go. here we go. That's right. Oh. oh. Well, I thought the bail arm's like open. I thought too. he would have sucked it in a bit. Yeah. Oh, no, Devo. Lost him. Yeah, he's still there. He's still there? Yeah. Maybe just put it back in the hole and let him eat it. Yeah. <laughs> or not. He looked like a decent fish, eh? It was decent. When I locked the bail arm open, I went, oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, he's still there. I can see it twitching, or something's there. Oh, yeah, or... Either that or the skippy moot. <laughs> there we go. Nah, this is not as big as the one you just hooked. Nah. <laughs> I reckon you've been baited. Probably. I'll uh, just let it sit there for now. Wow, what an awesome night though, eh? This is how Friday night should be. Every Friday night was calm like this, I'd be pretty happy. This is another one of those average just underies. Yeah. I don't know, he's quite a bit under him. <laughs> That's not what you hooked before though, eh? <laughs> Again, I just wound that to try and move my. I thought I'll just. That's better. Oh, that's a better one, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> boy. It was getting. It was on the bottom for a while. I thought I'll just. Oh. You might not be getting that. this one back. Yeah. <laughs> I just moved it because I thought I'll see if this is on the bottom. And as soon as I moved it, it just got angry. This I'm one's mine. Another half of this this is getting out. tapped as well. I don't know if you noticed. I might swap sides with you there. Uh, this might hook up any second now as well. Or oh, this is on the bottom. This feels like a better one. Good sunset behind you. Well, how was that? I just moved it like it, I moved it probably a couple of inches and then kaboom. So it must have, I don't know, just been sniffing it. Thought, hang on, that's getting away. I better hit it. <laughs> exactly what the other one did, that first one. Yeah, just one. a slow wind. At least I've turned it because I thought it was it was getting a bit angry to start with for a minute. Yeah, that was a good good first that run. Decent run. Oh my god, this reel. Honestly, if you're in the market for a new reel, check out the Certe. It's from Daiwa. Um, I don't know, some people like their Shimano's, I like Daiwa. This Certe my wife bought me for my birthday is absolutely spectacular. Yeah, they are at the higher end of the price bracket, but I think Do you want to swap sides I think it's worth it. No, no, I'm staying. I'm, I'm good. <laughs> I feel like I've got his measure. <laughs> Famous last words. I feel like I probably shouldn't have said that. Last time I said that, I got smoked. <laughs> it's got those big head shapes. I don't think it's a stingray. <laughs> <laughs> nah, he's not a stingray. Maybe a Sambo. 
or no? Yeah, but it's got a head shake, so. I don't know, hard to tell. Uh, I think it's just a good snapper. It might be, I don't know. It's I think it's just a good snap. Could be. I've got one more tag left, so if there's a good pinky, I'll stick a tag in him. Oh, jeez, it's got some power, eh? <laughs> it's got yeah. some weight and power Hellboy. behind it, for sure. <sighs> It's about now when you want to crank your drag up and just dictate terms and it's about now when you shouldn't crank your drag up and dictate terms because <laughs> sometimes I see the boat and I just get that last little burst of angriness. Here he comes. What I is think he? he's a pinky. Yeah, he's kind of long. Yeah. It's pinky, it's good. Yeah, he's, pink, yeah, he's oh, a good, that's he's a good pinky. That's a banger. Are you going to net this one for me? Yeah, I think that'd be nice if you did. Yeah. Oh, he's fat. Yeah, that's a banger. <laughs> <laughs> Grab the Reasonable. GoPro. Are you going to lift him? Yeah. Yeah. Oh my God, Dad. Yeah, that's he's a, a good one. Good snapper, man. <laughs> look at that. Oh my Lord, look at that hook. It's just about to fall out. Move the net. That hook Move is... the net. Get it out. Yeah, I know that hook's about to fall out. Look at that hook. It wow. is. Wow. Oh my god, it's held on by like a piece of skin. That's Look at why, that. That's why you don't tighten your drag. Look at that. See what I was talking about tightening my drag? That would have been good by a fish right there. Alright, quick want to sort him out. There's the hook. <laughs> Quickly wake a tag in his shoulder here. Boom. Tag him there. Hold that dog up. Oh, right, give him a measure first because he's he's too long for that. 87, 87 centimeters. Okay, yeah, that'll do, I guess. That's <laughs> the fish we came for. Chuffed. You beautiful. All right, I'm gonna put him back. All right, here we go. And swim, my man, swim. Hold him, don't spear. Oh, swim, no, dude. Swim, swim, swim. You, you got this. Sw you, didn't... you got this. Uh, he's gonna be good. You he's should have good. spun him. I told you to hold him. Up. You just let go. When you just let go of them like that, they never go right. Quick, right. should we chase him down? Oh, well, he's not upside down. No, he's gone. He's gone. He's gone. Slow release. <laughs> but he's gone. That was a big one. Yeah. Right, right, that's it for us. Sun's just gone down. It's not even properly dark, but we're gonna run in anyway. We're happy. We got a fish for dinner. Caught a good fish. Got a few runs. It's been a beautiful night. Um, I'm back out again in the morning with Jack anyway, so I'm happy to head in now. I've got to go home and slab that fish up that I've got there. And hopefully I'll get another episode tomorrow in the morning with Jack. Then I'm going into Big Five Marine to go and have a look at my new boat because the container arrived today and the new boat should be unloaded by tomorrow morning. So I'm going to go out and have a look at that. So I'll bring you guys along and film that when I'm out there. If you like our stuff, stay tuned and I'll see you in the next episode.